Hi, this is Scoggett, and today I'm going to be making some hickory smoked chicken legs on my Oklahoma Joe smoker, my way. Uh, me and Mr. Scoggett went to a, a barbecue uh, a couple weeks ago, and uh, the uh, was a friend of ours, well, a friend of, of hers, and uh, invited us over. So uh, we went over there for the uh, barbecue, and he made a... Uh, uh, some hot dogs, uh, hamburgers, and some chicken legs. Uh, so we got there and everything at the uh, barbecue, and uh, hey, come on in, Scoggett. Uh, glad you're here and everything. You want a Lone Star or Shiner? Sure, give me a Lone Star. Well, we got the food back here in the back. Uh, go on to the backyard. He's uh, uh, making the chicken. He's the king of the chicken. Let me tell you, he's the king of the chicken. So I got back there, and uh, he was cooking up the chicken, and and everything and had a plate of it already plated up and uh he had a had tin foil on it so he said you want one i said why well, sure uh you know uh, i'll go ahead and give it a try and he went ahead and uh got me one and uh whenever he did this is the way it looked it was burnt to a crisp and it was cold in the middle uh i really didn't want to eat it and he, he told me he said go ahead and take a bite see what what you think so i went ahead and took a bite of it it was burnt like i said uh on the outside and it was cold in the middle it wasn't even cooked in the middle and uh so i went ahead and took a bite i said mm, hey, yeah that's good i put it back on my my plate uh turned around and spit it out uh, it had a bad taste of that char. That char, man, it was bad. I mean, he burned it to a crisp. And he had a whole plate of it what he, what he messed up. And uh, Mrs. Goggins wouldn't eat it either. And I know everybody has went to these kind of barbecues where they have uh, experienced this. So today what I'm going to show you is how I do it, where you won't experience this burnt taste at all. And uh, I'm going to do this in three parts. And the first part is going to show show you how to uh, put them on the grill or, or the smoker, how to put them in the smoker. And the second part is uh, going to show uh, when to apply the barbecue sauce. And the third part is going to be the finished product. And I promise you, you won't have any char on it. And uh, uh, Mrs. Coggett told me, she says, you know, she said, maybe you need to make a video on this. And uh, I'll call them up and have them watch your video and uh, uh, see if see if he'll, he'll go from there and, and maybe uh, catch on to how to do it right. Uh, I'm not saying I'm the best maker of whenever it comes to chicken, but I know how to make chicken. And it's not going to be cold in the middle, I guarantee it. And it's not going to be burned on the outside. That's, that's my pet peeve when you bite into it. And it's cold in the middle, it's not even cooked. I mean, you're eating raw. If you eat it, you're eating, eating raw chicken. And there was kids there, and I thought, mm, man, the kids are going to get sick if they keep eating this. And, uh, of course, I didn't tell them nothing. I told, you know, uh, just went ahead. That was his house. That's why he barbecues. So uh, I, I just left it at that. But Mrs. Coggett said, make a video and uh, show the people how, how to make them. Uh, so that's what I'm doing. That's I'm going to try to educate you on how, how I make chicken my way and it will come out uh, perfect every time and uh, we'll go ahead and get started and uh, what I've got Is I got my Oklahoma Joe set up and it's going to be smoking you're going to want to smoke these This chicken is going to smoke at right around uh, 225, between 225 and 250 for about anywhere from 90 minutes, uh, about 90 minutes, about 90 minutes because I, I, uh, whenever I apply the barbecue sauce to it, I add an extra 30 minutes so it's going to be two hours. You're going to have this in there two hours. And uh, I'll go ahead and show you how to place this.
what I've got is uh, I've got some uh, chicken legs what I've uh, already put a little bit of rub and seasoning on and we're just going to put these on on the uh, in the smoker it's really not hard to do I kind of like to get them all facing the same way because to me it's easier to uh, work with whenever you go to take them off. And that's why you want to put them just similar to that. They can be backwards, forwards, in it, sideways. Uh, it don't matter if you're cooking more stuff and that's fine too. We're going to go ahead and shut the lid. And I've got my smoker uh, over here uh, going. I've got my hickory wood in, in the firebox. And we're going to go ahead and shut this up too. What we're going to do is we're going to maintain a fire of between 225 and 250 for this. And uh, we're going to let this smoke like for 90 minutes. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and let it go 90 minutes and then I'm going to come uh, have the second part. I'm going to show you uh, how to put the barbecue sauce on it and then we're going to let it smoke another 30 minutes. After an, uh, the another 30 minutes they're done and they're ready to take out. And I'll show you the finished product on the third video. I appreciate you watching the video. Uh, hope hope I was helpful on, on cooking ch chicken. And my brother, he says, you make the best chicken. I can't make chicken. I can't make chicken. And he said, I burn it up. I don't know how to do it. And I try to explain to him the way I do it. And, uh, well, what you say? I don't, I don't know. He still, he still can't make it. Uh, he's coming over tonight, and he's going to eat, eat my, uh, with us and eat the chicken. And uh, I, I know he's going to, going to like it. He always says, you make the best chicken. Uh, I'll have the second video coming up and uh, I appreciate you watching the video leave a comment whether you like the video whether you don't you can leave a comment whether you like me or not it's all good and uh, I appreciate you watching the video and y'all take care